After a year-long battle with ALS, well-known Jackson businessman and leader Leland Speed has died. The Mississippi Development Authority says it mourns the loss of their former director. 12 News' Gary Burton spoke with a close friend of Speed's. He joins us now in the studio. Gary? Yeah, the Downtown Jackson Partners, a company Leland Speed founded, was formerly headed by Ben Allen, who tells me he's not just an ordinary friend of Leland Speed, he's his best friend since 1997 when Allen was running for city council. Ben Allen describes his buddy as a brilliant, competitive Christian man that was annoyingly positive. Now, even as a successful businessman, Speed wanted communities in Mississippi to thrive. He served as an advocate for many civic engineering projects he was a representative on the Hines Rankin Pearl River Flood and Drainage Control Board, served on the JSU Development Board, and served as chair on the Board of Trustees for Mississippi College. There's an old bogus, incorrect saying that says everybody can be replaced, they can't. Everybody can't be replaced. You can't replace Abraham Lincoln, you can't replace George Washington, and you can't replace Leland Speed. He'll be remembered as his father was mayor. He, if everybody in Jackson had the positive attitude toward everything that Leland did, our city would have no worries, trust me. When I met him, he was uh, a very active board member, and uh, he was just a really, really smart, kind man that was willing to just uh, introduce you to people to make sure that you, you, you had what you needed to, to do your job well. And Senator Roger Wicker released a statement on the loss of speed, saying, quote, Gail and I mourn the loss of our longtime friend and one of our state's preeminent citizens, Leland Speed. As a leader in business and government, he demonstrated the highest commitment to civic duty and the advancement of our state and country. His advocacy for the Junior ROTC was the inspiration for the Junior ROTC Act, which has expanded opportunity for thousands of young Americans. Now, this is just one example of Leland's impact. His enduring influence on the lives of Mississippians will be hard to measure, and he leaves a wonderful legacy for his family and his many friends, end quote. Leland Speed was 88 years old. For 12 News, I'm Gary Burton. Thank you, Gary. Now, I reached out to Leland Speed's son, Warren, this afternoon, and this is what he said about his beloved father. Dad was an amazing man who had a deep love for his city and state. He taught us to leave a place a little bit better than you found it. My brothers and I are so grateful to have had a man like him as our father.